Yes! I did it! I reached the goal! Goal? What were you trying to achieve? While doing the challenge last episode, I made a campaign to give Blueprint some limbs. I got enough signatures to make it happen. Your limbs? I want to see. Here he comes now. What's the news? Blueprint? Seguro que de vez diferente. Yup. Now I can play my music with style. Now, how do I look? You're looking really swell, buddy. Definitely. In all honesty, you look a little different. Still looks way weird to me. Kinda of cool though. No! He's the same loser as before! Are you ever respectful, Renji? It's a cool new do. Being nice is overrated, Blackjack! Pardon me? I'm a gin rummy card. Still bad nonetheless! Can I stop clapping now? Anyway, fix it. It's elimination time. One of you will be abducted away to the contestant crybaby cage. Safe contestants get shovels. They'll help you in the challenge today. Woo! Shovely! Now, unfortunately, since team leaders would get immunity, the same applies to your oblivious one. Well, then give me my stupid prize already! Ah! That was just unsettling. Lampy and Sombrero are preferably the first two safe. Eso es menor. Boom! Take that, Watery! Well, along with Mustache and Blueprint, Watery, you're safe too. Whee! Cardi's safe. Yes! And Saki and Orangey are safe. Oh my glob, yes! Quiet! I'm in the bottom three! Wait, what? Only three contestants are left! Well, who even cares? Not like I have a chance anyway. Actually, Gravy, you're the next safe. Now I'm in the bottom two. This is the happiest day of my life. Oh no, I'm getting very scared. I don't want to leave this early. The last contestant safe is... Medley. Yes! And that's what you get for an awful plan, Blender. What? Are you kidding me? Blender, not a surprise. You're the second contestant eliminated. No, I can't be eliminated. I actually did something. I tried. Ha, <laughs> that was fun to watch. If you copy what he did, you might be next. Like that's going to happen. Everyone loves me. <laughs> Absolutely not true. STOP TALKING OUT OF YOUR butt. Next challenge. Hmm, that elimination made me happy. That's one less member for the fix-its. Yeah. Whoopee. What's wrong, Spaghetti? <sighs> Nothing much. Whatever's the matter, I hope you feel better soon. Contestants, it's time for your third team challenge. Just making sure, is it going to be another difficult one? No. The next challenge takes place near the famous High Score Shore up in the north. To get there, I'm taking a double-decker bus. Hop in, y'all! That looks so fun! Thank you! Double-decker bus? Sweet! Burger Bonnies, let's get to the top! Come on! Nippy! Let's go! Eh, not again. Look at that view! It's a stupid view. Hey, Dead Football, I have a question. Oh, what is it, Spaghetti? Why do you have that on your head? Oh, this thing, it, it has a backstory. A few years back, I was simply known as football. My father was a professional knife thrower and would normally take me to his contests. But that one day, 
That dreaded day. His opponent threw a knife at my head by accident. The doctor later told me that I can't remove or touch it, as it would lead to my foot kicking out unpredictably. But gotta be honest, it's a nice tattoo job. If I were to pull that on my head, which is very difficult, I would probably and officially die. Do cookie and toilet paper know? Actually, no, they don't. They don't know about the disability I have. I don't think anyone does. Well, I'll be aware of it. Don't worry about a thing. Thanks, Spaghetti. Dude, that was awesome! Thanks, I'm so glad I have limbs now. And this amazing guitar right here. I wish I had limbs. I could climb to the peak of Mount Scam Ad from here. Scam Ad? I've seen safer tricks in fairy tales. Why do you have to act like such a child all the time? <laughs> Look at who you're talking to, buddy. Welcome, Final 22, to the High Score Shore, famous tourist spot where you can get your surfs on. What might our next challenge be, my awesome host? I appreciate the compliment, Rising Rockstar. For your challenge, you'll have to build a giant sandcastle. Me parece bastante facile. I should probably inform you that not only does your sandcastle have to be giant, but to secure the victory for your team, it also needs to be sturdy. Build cautiously. Oh, don't worry. We work just as well as mechanics themselves. We sure do. That's good. So, build a giant sandcastle. Make sure it's secure. After about an hour, I will come and judge your castles based on their strength. Whichever team builds the strongest sandcastle will win the challenge, while the other team will lose their second member. So all you do is... build? Did you even hear Red at all? Um, I think. It's very simple. Just build a big and strong sandcastle. Alright, get to it! Okay team, we won last time, and want to win again. Any ideas for the castle? Um, how tall should we make it? I'll try a castle that stands pretty tall around twice my height. That big? I kind of want something a little more simpler. Well, you'll never know if you don't go. And afterward, we can focus on stronger touch-ups. Okay. Bye bye me, everyone. Let's win this! Okay, Tom Tums, what horrible ideas do you have? Can you not say mean things like that? No one asked, imbecile. How about, since it needs to be so tall, we make it as tall as the sky. Boom, I'm bored. Creo que deberíamos hacer que sea una atoro normal. Tal vez agregar algunos pilares para obtener más aporte. That's honestly not a bad idea. I'll go get a ton of sand. Ooh! Look! My whole family's beyond that reef! That's just the sea! Oh my glob, are you that kind of idiot? I'm afraid we'll do worse if we keep fighting. Bro, if you need any help, you can stick by me. Me, myself, and I can save the day. Wow. Didn't know. Good job so far, team. I told you we worked so well. I gotta ask, whose idea was it for the drawbridge? Mine, for style points. And plus, that's very strong for an entrance. Way to go, Snowflake. Pink sunglasses, come here. I need to show you something right now. Okay? Uh, what a waste of time. P.S. Don't you get it? That is an ancient underwater base. Really? I didn't know it was ancient. You didn't hear the stories? That building is made of a special type of rock discovered thousands of years ago. And it's right in front of us. I want to dive right in there and see it close up. Whoa, whoa, be careful, pink sunglasses. I heard theories that if you go down there at the wrong time, a giant eel will come out and attack. I do the research, but nobody brought a laptop with them to this beach. Wow, this was surprisingly interesting to learn about. Thanks for the history lesson, Illuminati. Remember, if you need any help, come to the Triangle! Whew, I gotta turn the pillars up. That took me a light year. Sweet, progress is being made. Yay, progress is being downgraded. Grapey, why? Why have you been so negative lately? You haven't been this pessimistic before. Why should someone like you care? Do you even see me as a friend at all, Grapey? Someone you care about at all? You know what? No! I am done with people trying to cheer me up! 
They do a better job of being annoying than being friendly. What's the point? Leave me alone and never talk to me again! Okay, though you are going to regret the day you said this. With no one else to talk to. Boo! Who? What? In a way. Leave me alone. Go somewhere else. We already won, dumbbell. Leave me alone and never talk to me again. Oh no. What have I done? <sighs> How's the castle going so far? Bien hacer anora. On que un poco hago de dor. Yeah, I agree. It's so much sand. Keep going. I know we can do well. <sighs> I'm so exhausted. Well, we're nearing completion. We're doing really good so far. Two, I hear something. <laughs> no I trust you no more, sad boy. Ow! Okay, who's cheating this time? It wasn't my fault. Someone made me knock it down. It's part of a disability I have, I swear! Disability? It has a backstory to it. I'm gonna walk away. I just can't trust those fix-its. Yeah, well, you don't want to miss this. Spaghetti, you're amazing! Did he just construct a backup? Sweet! Wow, a second castle. Isn't that cool, Plum? Eh, uh, not bad. Just glad we have something. You really gotta keep your pessimism to a minimum. And with that, it's been an hour. Time to check out your sandcastles. Shut up and tell us who's going first! Just because you yelled violently, your team's going last. This is why you don't act like such a meanie. Team birthday party, show me what you got! At first, we had a decent castle. Although, someone made DF knock it down though. Just why is everyone toying with them right now? However, we have this backup castle. Look at all the details. It has everything. It's awesome. Overall, it's really nice. Really sturdy. I give it an 8 out of 10. We got a good score. Yay! Moving on to the fix-its. All right, we have a pretty simple castle. Decent pillars to hold it all up. I like the pillar designs very well. It does feel more like a base than a castle, but whatever. I have to point out this. Oh, nothing to worry about. Cheated a little, but that's all right. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. I thought Watery would stop sitting right next to me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I need some light. You can also sit under the literal sun, you simpleton. I like this castle, but not as much as the other one by just a little bit. Seven out of ten. Oh my glob, that brings my word! Wow! Yeah! Say a couple. We were so close. That's okay. We did good. Alright, viewers. I know some of you are sad that you can't vote, so I'll give you a little compromise. In the poll in the description, choose the contestant you think should receive a little reward at the elimination ceremony next episode. Whoever gets the most likes wins a prize. The elimination votes are still from contestants, which means you guys can't eliminate anybody. Sorry. And with that, stay tuned next episode to find out who wins the prize and who gets eliminated. See you in 084!